Hello mga ka-arts! It's Eliza and again, welcome back to my channel. By the way, before we start, please forgive me if I sound whispering because I'm actually whispering because it's 4 a.m. and people are still sleeping and this is the only time I can record voiceover so yeah. Um, for today's video, it's a time-lapse video inspired by a nursery rhyme. It's from YouTube. The name of the channel is Coco Melon and the title of the song is The Ants and the Grasshopper. While watching that video, no actually, while watching that video together with my baby because I will not watch that video if it's not because of her. So while watching that video, I saw this big red mushroom where the grasshopper is standing and I don't know, for me it looks so cute and I feel compelled to draw that so here I am making this video. But I did not just copy it as it is, I searched different pictures from the internet, um, by the way, I get my most of my reference from pexels.com because all the pictures there are royalty free picture that you can use as reference. So if you want to have that reference that is royalty free and no copyright just go to pexels.com I'll just put the link of that website below. and. Yeah, search whatever you want because there is thousands of pictures that you can use as reference for your drawing or paintings. So back to the drawing. After I searched, I did not copy the mushroom as it is because the mushroom I want to paint is I want it to have a little dreamy effect, not just like a bright red little mushroom on the side of the road but I wanted to have a um, fairy tale effect <laughs> something like that something like in the fairy tale by the way the brush that I'm using in this video was the brush that I ordered from Shopee and I ordered it for only 22 pesos i ordered three and it's small medium and large also i make a review video for this three brushes if it's good or not or if it's fine to use or whatever so if you want to watch that video i'll just put the link of that video down below the source of light of this mushroom was from the top so for it to be visible I draw a light with the word light on it so it will be obvious now I'm trying to fix the tonal value to the drawing the transition from light to dark I'm darkening the parts where the light is not reaching at this part of the video you know that feeling of when you're making a drawing you're really so focused in it like to the point of you're not even aware of the people around you or the environment when where you are in that's the time I was feeling in this part of the video but then <sighs> this thing happens My baby woke up from sleep and if you're a mom and at the same time you're an artist I know you know the feeling all the excitement all the focusness that you have when you come back to the drawing it's all gone and you need to start all over again to be focused and into to be into the drawing mode again 
so after maybe walk up then of course i need to stop drawing and just post the video and go to her so at this part this is the next part of the video where my baby is already sleeping again um i forgot to mention i want to thank all those people who support this channel who subscribe to this channel and or giving likes to my videos because i already reached 100 subscribers um thank you thank you so much i'm so happy and because of that i want to make more videos because i feel energized <laughs> So thank you so much, um, please continuously support and I hope I can make more videos so I can help you even more with your art journey. Also if you have any questions or suggestions or what video you want me to make for the next um, feel free and don't hesitate to write a comment down below I'm reading all of them and also for me to have an idea what you want to see And that's the end for today's video. I hope you enjoy this video um, as I enjoy this. And uh, see you again next time.